Hello friends, what's up? Welcome back to the channel. Um, today I'm going to do a flip through of my personal ring planner. Um, this is for the month of November. You guys know I like to change my cover and decor every month. Um, so that's, that's what I'm working with. This is the um, print Prussian personal ring cover from the Patina collection. This is the color maple. I looked it up. Um, it is a beautiful cover. I love it. It's, it feels so good in my hand. Um, I was in this last November actually. So in the spirit of using what I have, right? Um, so it does have 30 millimeter rings in it. Um, now the rings do kind of turn a little bit and I think it's just because of like what's inside. I've got my little coaster that my daughter made me years ago with my coffee. Yeah, it doesn't have a back pocket but I love like how it's like slim profile, which I absolutely love. So, um, this is what I got going on here. Um, it's the same pocket configuration as the cover I was in last month and the same exact stuff from last month, aside from this sweet little note from my daughter. Um, and I may have changed the color of the Ollie clip I used to be perfectly honest, but that's it. So just, I have like this piece of laminate here since it doesn't come with a fly leaf. I wanted something to protect everything. Um, so I just stuck that in there. It's just an old piece. I think this is from the mom planner. It was a freebie sticky notes galore. Um, this was from caffeine and paper co sweet freckle designs inbox is the same um and disclaimer guys like my like system works so I pretty much keep it the same I might change like inserts or whatnot but the guts of my planner is pretty much the same every month um so this is my inbox dash I did add these little lists from uh the SM plans Facebook group just to kind of list out some stuff and I look at me I did do that I did do that and did do that um so yeah we each like uh Thanksgiving assignments is like what's everyone bring in so and then I've got like just regular paper here I like to use these for my grocery lists this is a brain dump from Chibs um House of Chibs or Writing with Chibs on Instagram of her um so these are some old dividers I can't remember if these were in last month's setup or not I made these a long time ago um, the digital is from Latua Notes. Um, I do have a PR code for her shop. It's linked down below. Um, but I just DIY'd these using Canva and um, Bellum and a laminator and scissors. Word of the year create. I made this at the beginning of the year. And I wanted that reminder. I wanted to, you know, we're in the last two months of the year. I wanted to finish strong with my, with my word of the year. And I feel like looking at the definition of create. I did create um, a lot of wonderful things for my family and I this year. Um, I think this was from Jessica, planning professor. So freebie on her Instagram. My lists are the same. Like nothing changes with my lists. I mean, um, these are all a two notes insert. So it's just like a planner wish list, wish list, TV shows, podcasts, books, day trip ideas, fountain pen wish list, and the list goes on. Pretty simple. Um, you know, random recipes, random, uh, sticky notes, planner thoughts. Um, I need to update this and like really hunker down. I haven't even thought about my 2023 lineup. People have been asking me and I'm like, probably what I already have. So I haven't bought a new weeks for next year. Um, we'll see. I, I plan to buy a weeks for next year. I'm wondering about the cousin. Do you go want a cousin or do you go want a day free? So it's just kind of going to depend. I also have like a B6 allergy sitting beside me that I pulled some pages out. Um, I took some financial notes. These are all Latua notes inserts except for, I'll show you guys. Um, I did like, uh, yeah, I was just like doing notes to be honest with you. Like insurance notes, um, notes for a family beach vacation, that type of stuff. These notes pages are from uh, Pen, Paper, and Plans, and these are freebies from Hey Planner Girl. Um, more beach trip stuff. We have a family beach trip in June that I'm, um, my, like, my parents and my family are sharing a condo. So, we are um, looking at, like, condos and stuff like that on the beach. So, we've been, I've, we've been, like, chatting back and forth trying to find good deals and, you know, taking notes and 
you know, half of that is how much, you know, that type of stuff. Um, this is from Latua Notes. And then more Latua Notes. This, <laughs> I'm going to keep it in here for next year, right? Um, and then my family section, which is more like my home slash family section. Um, Luna Lou's Plans. This is from Suzy Key Plans. Cool mom. I love this dashboard. The clip is from Pen, Paper, and Plans. And then I just have notes from my Sophie. Um, that's a freebie from Latua Notes. That's from Pen, Paper, and Plans. I always put this in the month of Thanksgiving. Crazy thankful. Um, so I need to do some updating with this list, but this is like favorite dinners, um, Trader Joe's favorites, our master grocery list. These are things that I buy regularly, and so I keep it on a list, and when I am planning my grocery trips or whatever, I have it here, so that way I can, you know, check and see if we have it or whatnot or if we need it that type of thing. This is my monthly meal plan. I need to start working on December. Today is the 27th. Um, so I do meal plan for the month in an attempt to keep myself organized and to really reduce grocery costs so that I'm not like wandering aimlessly through the grocery store trying to figure out what ingredients will comprise a meal. I don't know where this is from. I think this is like planning with jazz freebies maybe. My uh, cleaning routine, still the same. Um, my home to buy list and declutter list, home repairs list, and boom. Um, and then this is the autumn winter planner from Latua Notes. This is a very small portion of it. Um, so I've got this December monthly, and this is specific to what Christmas activities can we do um, during this time of year. This is not like for planning. This is to note things going on in the community so that I am aware of it. So that way we can, you know, if we have the time or there's not anything planned on that day, we could go. Um, I'm keeping a list of, <clears throat> so this is for my oldest daughter, what people are buying her so that we're not duplicating. So when somebody's like, oh, I got her this and I got her that, it's here. And doing this, I'm doing the same for both of my children. Um, some notes of things that we want to do, like for Christmas experiences. Um, let's see. I've got their wish list. Uh, yeah. So, I've got like uh, Malaya, Sophie, and Jesse, my husband. I need to add his parents on here and then a little something for my parents. My brother and I were talking about maybe like going in on, um, cause we usually don't exchange gifts, but I kind of want to get my parents something for Christmas this year. Um, so we were talking about like maybe going in and buying like a gift card to the movies and then a gift card to like somewhere they can eat a nice dinner, like so they could have a date night. thought that would be fun. So I have all of these in case I need them for gift list ideas or whatever. Um, this is from Latua Notes, sweater weather, pen paper and plans. I have a code. I think it's active. Um, she, uh, I think Karen said that she's gonna let me keep my code for YouTube viewers. So that's cool. Um, and then this is like my kids, uh, like if they miss school, if they're late for school, if they're, you know, this is like where I keep track of that stuff cycle. Uh, that's my kids school calendar. Um, oh Lord, hold on. I have a expense tracker for childcare expenses. Um, and then my family's health log. I haven't been doing a great job keeping up with that too, by the way. Um, and then we move into my schedule. See, it's all the same. Like not a whole lot changes with my planning because it is what it is. I have a video um, <laughs> exporting that I'm, I'm trying to upload my plan with me. <clears throat> These are both Latua notes. I think that's the freebie. And then this is her vintage bundle, I believe. I love them. They're beautiful. Year at a glance, I never did mark October. Um, list of holidays, my reoccurring tasks list. These are tasks that I don't always, I need to replace our toothbrushes, um, that I don't do regularly, that I need to be reminded to do. And this is how I try to hold myself accountable. <laughs> um, so yeah, 
this is my uh, future log or important dates. This is for, because I don't, I only keep like a couple of months of monthlies in here, a couple, you know, I don't keep like the entire year in here. So it's important for me to have something that like for 2023, like we have a lot of like things already planned for 2023 and I need it noted here um, so that I don't forget about it. Uh, so these are from Peanuts Planner Co. And then I have these from Franklin Planner that I just, I trimmed them down and stuck them in here. That's from Paper Planner Bliss. And then my monthly section. Ooh, I whistled my sh <laughs> Um, This is from Plan With B. I love this. Like, I was like, I need to paint this. That'd be so pretty. Um, so November monthly. Pretty simple. This is from Dee's Plans over on Instagram. I did clean out my closet. See, I didn't, uh-oh, my battery's low. I did not bog myself down with tasks um, for this month because I didn't want to. And then um, December, I need to start planning for December. Um, let's see, more Latua notes. This is my <laughs> running brain dump um, so far for November. And then my weeklies. So I bounced weeklies a lot this month. I don't typically do that. I usually stick to a weekly. But um, this was a week that I just like didn't feel like printing. I think in the spirit of saving time. Um, I painted this. I have this um, this paint with me on my channel. This dashboard here. It's SM Plans. And then these are Plan With B weekly inserts. So just use them how I need them. I have a video. Um, I just filmed this plan with me. Fill in the greens. And then this was last week. See, I was insert jumping because I had this on hand as well. Um, this is from Chibs Shop. I loved this insert. So those are my weeklies. That's kind of like where like my, this is my schedule, right? Like this is like, if you look, this is like, tells me like all of my time specific things. Um, not, not necessarily work related. That's from Pen, Paper, and Plans. These little dividers are from Pen, Paper, and Plans, too. Um, picture of my girlies. I found these $2 bills. So I just stuck them in here. And then these were my dailies for the first two days of the month because that's all I could muster. And then I have, like, a hybrid daily happening here. This was SM Plans and Planner Room. And I was doing these, like, day on two pages. Um, and I just was like, yeah, it was like brain dump everything in my mind. I was little like micro journaling. These are plenty of room. I don't know if I said that. And I was when I had that migraine and then I had another, and then I used just one side for my schedule. And then this side I just used for another daily. I actually split it up into two days. Um, and then these are from Latua Notes. Got all fancy there. And this is today. So, as you guys can see, I don't plan. I don't do a daily every day. Like, I do it as I need it. And sometimes I don't need it. Sometimes my weekly is sufficient. Um, but sometimes I just need to, like, get stuff out of my head um, and onto paper. Or if it's a really busy day, I need to, like, see my schedule blocked off. So, it just kind of depends on what I need at the moment. Um, I've got this... Uh, this is from SM Plans. I use this to kind of keep track of my days. And I have a lot of inserts in here, like chips, Latua notes. I think I've got some Jessenia printables. Yeah, got that one in there. And that's that. And then this is my Tiffany section or my goals section. So font is from Via Creations, and then the background is from Latua. That's from Pen Paper and Plants, my minimal planner. My annual goals. You know, I did really good this year in one area of my life and that was career and relationships i will say that these two priority these two i struggled um so not like struggled like terribly but struggled for sure had to get a sip of coffee smart goals is from bite size plans on instagram it's a freebie and then this is my monthly plan this is how i track my my main goals for the month so I wanted to do a closet clean out it was done whoop, whoop. and then reduce my food budget by $50 I don't know if that's gonna do but we'll see 
And then these are my weekly tasks and I don't use this daily. Um, I used to, then I was like, it's too much. Um, this is where I journal um, about my goal progress, Latua notes, and then I've got my health log. This Don't Quit Vellum is from Via Creations. That's from Susie Q Plans. This is my workout overview. Um, I did do some walking like over the past couple of days, um, but I didn't like log it on my Fitbit. So I don't know how far I walked. Like it was just like, let's walk around and walk the dog. Um, and so, and a lot of movement, like yard work and stuff like that. So I counted as exercise on my tracker, but I don't, I haven't, I didn't write it because it wasn't like an official exercise. Um, so yeah got some work to do. This is my obsolete glow up tracker that I haven't done anything with since September 5th. So it's just in here hanging out. This is still that move challenge from yoga with Adrian. Haven't used it. Um, I like to keep my tracker from the previous month in here and I do that so that I can compare how I did in um, with my habits and also with my mood, with my sleep, all of that. So that's why I keep the previous month in here. That's another Latua notes, pen, paper, and plans. So I had, I was trying not to print stuff in November, to be honest with you guys. And I had a whole bunch of these printed in my little storage binder that I have. So I just used this. Um, the SM plans one has more lines as you can see, which is why I liked it, but this is sufficient. So this is where I track, like these are my habits that I want to do regularly. Um, and then I track my energy, my overall mood of the day, and then how much sleep I got. Like I was like eight hours. I had a lot of seven hour sleep days, which is phenomenal for me and not a whole lot of five hour sleep days, which is even better for me. So I'm seeing some improvement there. And then my content, you guys, I haven't used this section. I didn't even do a monthly plan for content. The only thing I'm using this for right now, and I need to move this, is um, where I track my YouTube uploads. So, and then my confidential section stays in here. Just has some information that I may need to reference, but it's confidential. That's from Calixta Creations, and then I got this Foxy Fix page lifter. Um, my mood stickers from V shop and then my brain, my, my brain, <laughs> I have this card from the planner spot where I have like extra sticky notes if I need them <clears throat> just shoved in here. And that is my setup. Um, again, that's what I was like saying, like, I just don't change a lot and I'm probably not going to change a lot. I'm probably going to move, um, since I moved out of my A5, cause my A5 was like my home management. So it had like my... Um, it had like home maintenance, car maintenance, that type of stuff in there along with my budget. But since I've moved my budget to the budget, um, mom's budget by paycheck workbooks, I just don't have a need for that binder anymore. So I need to make a home, like in my family or home section, I need to put that information into here and just let this be a true catch all that has everything in it. Um, and I think it'll be sufficient. So anyway, all right, well, I will try to, I'm not going to link everything. Um, oh, I didn't show you guys this. I'm sorry. This was funny. This note. So, so you wrote, I love money. It's like me too, girl. <laughs> Um, but anyway, I'm not going to link all the shops down below. I will list the shops that I mentioned. Um, and you can typically find them on Instagram or Etsy or Shopify. So, um, it just takes me way too long to link shops and I just, yeah, I don't have the time to do that. So sorry, friends, if you, um, are struggling to find something, just let me know and I will help you with that. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you have any questions, feel free to comment those down below. If you enjoyed it, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. I will see you guys in my next video. And I hope you have a fabulous day.